snap, snap, check, check. Hey everybody, it's Matt with Everywhere Auto. Uh, shit, I better turn this up. Hey everybody, it's Matt with Everywhere Auto Repair. Today what I'm gonna be talking to you about is how to make sure you don't get ripped off. Let's talk about some places not to find a mechanic. The family mechanic. Your uncle's buddy, your dad's buddy, your friend, you know, or their mechanic. You don't know that guy. You don't know that guy. How well do they know that guy? The two places I recommend looking are Craigslist, and Google, but Google then Craigslist. I like going on. I like going on Google and finding the negative reviews, and then you see how the how the owner responds to the negative reviews. Is he a jerk? Is he real professional, even to people that maybe they're? What if so? What if somebody's right? What if somebody set has a negative criticism that is valid? You know, does he acknowledge that? Does he, does he take responsibility or does he just blow it off? Does he just disrespect the customer? Look at the way he reacts to an unsatisfied customer. Does he try to empathize with that person or does he just blow them off? You gotta find a place that has a significant amount of reviews. Four or five isn't gonna cut it. Especially if you live in a big city, these people need to have like 20 or 30 reviews. Now, that's not to say just because somebody has four or five reviews that they're not gonna be a good person. It's just that, do you really wanna be the, the te do you wanna be the guinea pig? Do you wanna find out if this guy is trustworthy? Cause I mean, I could get four or five buddies to write good reviews. Another place to find a mechanic is Craigslist. What I would recommend is going on Craigslist and finding somebody who has a, a respectable advertisement and then you take their phone number and or their business name or whatever and you go onto Google and you look them up and you see what their Google reviews look like. Are you seeing a pattern here? It all comes back to Google. If they don't have good Google reviews, what's the point? And you know, there's Yelp, but who goes on Yelp? Not to say I don't go on Yelp. All right, so once you find a mechanic that has good reviews that you can reasonably trust, give them a call, see if they work on your vehicle, see if they can help you with your problem. For example, if you're gonna have them diagnose something, find out what it costs for them to diagnose something. Do they have a flat rate? Do they charge by the hour? Do they put the diagnostic fee towards any repairs? How do they determine their repair costs? Find all these things out, ask them. Once you figure out the problem, how do you determine, uh, how do you determine the pro, how do you determine the price? If you know what you need done, get a price up front. If they can't give you a price up front, ask them how they come up with their pricing. So that's what I recommend. Go ahead and look on Google, look on Craigslist. If you're trying to find a mechanic that's trustworthy, that's not gonna scam you. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them down in the comments below. Go ahead and like and subscribe if you haven't already. Keep an eye up the hill, guys.